Did you know gifting coins to your spouse, partner, or friend may not be a taxable event? Today, I'll show you how to reduce your taxes by properly marking gifts in CoinLink. Before we jump in, the information in this video is for educational purposes only and is not tax, financial, or legal advice. Also, the examples I mentioned might not exactly match your situation. So as always, speak to a qualified professional if you're looking for tax advice. Hello, my name is Nelly and welcome back to another video. Today, we're talking about gifts and specifically the tax implications of crypto gifts. Firstly, if your country does not allow tax-free gifts, then you do not need to make any changes to your transactions. You can go to our guides page, which I will leave down below. We have detailed articles about many different countries and their regulations surrounding this topic. And a small note here, the gift tag should only be applied to tax-free gifts. If you're unsure whether your gift is taxable or not, then you should consult your CPA or a tax agent. All right, without further ado, let's talk about the steps, starting off with sending a gift. You're gonna go in your CoinLink account and go to the Transactions tab. Then you will find and tag a withdrawal as a gift. Make sure to copy the cost basis shown on the left side of the transaction and share it with your partner. And now from the receiving gift side, find the incoming deposit transaction and click on edit. You should see a little change button next to the worth. Enter the cost basis that we talked about earlier that you copied that was provided to you by the giver and hit save. And a small note here, you do not have to tag the received gift as anything. Just leave it as a deposit. However, you may want to add a description to help you remember all of this later. And that's really it. Those are the only steps you need to follow. You have the set from the sender side and one from the receiver side. But I do hope you found this video helpful. If you did, consider dropping a like and subscribing for more crypto content. If you need further assistance, I've left a bunch of different resources down below, like our forum section, our help center, and more contact information. 